Hi everyone, welcome to Linda's Thrifty Life in day eight of Vlogmas, December 8th already. Oh my goodness, this month will fly by. It always does. December, you think you have weeks and weeks to do things and then before you know it, it's Christmas Eve, you know, and you're like, wow, you know. So, um, I am doing well. I hope you all are. It is a beautiful day. It's a little cool out, but you know, it is December, even here in Georgia. So, <clears throat> yesterday I had hoped to finish packaging and get things um, in the mail today. That did not happen because I ended up going um, shopping. So mom and I had sat and discussed, you know, and I was going over my list of things I needed and I was putting together my little packages to go out and I realized I am missing some stuff. So I thought yesterday, being a Monday, was a good day to go um, out shopping and I, I checked our stores. So every store I went into was not very crowded. Everybody pretty much was wearing masks. You, there's always the one or two. And um, I did my social distancing. So the first place I went was Michael's. Um, I went in to buy a paper pad for a friend of mine. Uh, and I also, of course, had to check the dollar stickers again because, you know, last time I only got through a few things. But this time I, I bought several and for friend mail and for uh, Christmas cards and stuff. So I'm not sharing any of those, but I did find a few that I want to show you. <laughs> Look at this. Kitty cat Christmas. Oh my gosh. They only had two packages of this. And I, these Jolie stickers are so cute. Look at this one with him going down the chimney. <laughs> the cat butt. It's got a star where the <laughs> where the booty is. <laughs> I love it. So I ended up only getting getting two of these, which is all they had. And then you know I I saw this. Isn't that cute? It was only a dollar, and it's so pretty. And you can put a picture in there or something. I don't know. I just had to have it. I found some other Christmas things, of course. And then is this not the most? beautiful flamingo stickers that have ever been made. I mean, look at that. They have feathers, uh, jewels, f flowers. Oh, oh my gosh. So those jumped in my cart and said, we're going home with you. <laughs> so I had a great, I had a great um, time there. I did also buy this box back here. It's one of those photo boxes and it says Joy on it. They were on sale for $2.99 and it'll be the perfect size to um, keep my Christmas cards and things in. And it said Joy. I already said that, didn't I? <laughs> so then I went to Dollar Tree I and there was not very many people there. I have to tell you they had been wiped out over the weekend. Their Christmas aisles were down to just um, gift bags, some boxes, a few little odd items here and there, stockings and hats, and a few ornaments. It was like, you know, like the locusts had come through. <laughs> so I was like, wow, I'm glad I got what I got when I got it. How does that sound? And um, all the cute wall signs and yard signs, totally gone. So I'm so glad I got my gnome for the holidays sign when I did. I only saw it one time, and I'm so glad I bought it. And, uh, of course, I've never seen the big gnomes, but my sweet friend Vani is sending me one. Thank you so much. It was supposed to come today, but the mailman didn't bring it. The mail is so messed up. I don't know. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> so, the big reason I went, well, one of the big reasons was because I wanted to get some candy. Um, I thought I had bought candy for the kids. Um, you know, I do their little mailboxes, and I fill them with candy, and every year they look forward, where's our mailboxes, Grandma? So, um, I had bought one little package of the Andes mints, and when I realized 
I split that and I and my mom likes them, so I like to put a few in the little bag of goodies I give her. There weren't very many in there. So I bought one more bag of Andy's Mims. And they really like Kit Kats. This is something that their mom gets them for uh, a snack, a candy. They don't keep a lot of candy, but she will get Kit Kats. So I got 10 pieces of those, one for each of them. Um, I'll put a couple of these Hershey bars in there just for some chocolate. And then I got um, this cute bag of these little mini pop, the charms. They like these and um, I'll put some in their, in their mailbox and then the rest will go into my candy dish because when they come here, Scout especially likes, likes candy a lot. So I don't I don't always give my mom something big for Christmas because um, she's really hard to buy for. I mean, she she has everything she needs, more than everything she needs. And when she, you know, wants something, she usually gets it. And um, so it's hard to figure out things for her. A lot of times when I'm out shopping, I'll find something and I'll go, oh, good. But just to off the top of my head, it was it's pretty hard this year. I do give her a subscription that I renew each year to Food Magazine, and she loves it. She just really looks forward to it. And um, so um, I've done that, and then I'm going to make her a little gifty bag, you know, with just some snacks. And she likes these sunshine snacks, so I got her a couple of more of those. And she likes these little Danish-style butter cookies. So I'm about them, but she likes them, and I thought... This was such a cute little tin instead of the big tin, just a little tin. And then she can use the tin for something else. And I'm also going to um, get one of my little Christmas tins and put some buttons in there. We were talking about buttons the other day, and I think I've ended up with most of her button collection that she's just for years and years and years kept, and then I've added to it. I love buttons. I do not sew, but I do love buttons. <laughs> So I think I'm going to make her a really special little box of buttons, and um, I just think she'll have fun. It was just a memory we had the other day. So let me move these out of the way. Sorry for the rattling. So, you know, walking around the store, I had to find a few other things. I did pick up some batteries. Mom wanted some, so I've already given her her batteries. Last time I was there, I was looking for these brown paper bags. But Well, I was looking for decorated paper bags, and I didn't get them, and I didn't buy the brown ones. So I'm gonna, I bought the brown ones to learn to make some of those paper bag um, little books. Yes, I did. <laughs> I'm going to try that. I also got um, this little Special Moments photo album. These are great if you're making like um, an embellishment, um, you know, die cut, die cut um, gift for someone. And I think you can take out the um, cover and cover it with something else if you wanted. But I thought that one was, was pretty. Um, I bought a little book. Um, but I'm not going to share it. It's a, it's a surprise. And then I told you how much I love these spoons. So I bought some more spoons. Um, a couple people have said, I really love those spoons. So <laughs> you never know what might be coming in the mail to you. So, And then I bought myself one, one little gift. Oh, first I bought these little bowls. I love these for prep. They're really fun. I bought a set for mom too. She loves them. But this was my little gift to myself. I know. I mean, it looks like a poodle to me. Do you think it's a poodle? <laughs> that part made me go, that's a poodle. I want a poodle dog. You know, I love poodles. <laughs> it's the only dog. I do like dogs. I like other dogs too, but I love poodles. So <laughs> that'll go in my stocking. <laughs> to Linda from Santa. <laughs> Oh, that was fun. That was a fun time. There wasn't a whole lot of new stuff, um, I must say. Um, and I've been much better about being very discerning about what I what I purchased. You know, you can just have so much stuff, I've decided. 
So then I did go to Aldi and I bought some groceries and mom and I were in a snacky mood. So holiday time snacks to like have like a summer sausage and cheese and crackers and things like that around. So I did a little of that shopping too and came home and it was a lot of fun. I had a good time. But oh, I was tired last night when I came on and made my video. So today I wanted to just share my little shopping with you and tell you that I need to get to work. I need to get to work and get these, these packages ready to go to the um, post office. I don't want to go more than one time. So I say tomorrow is it, everyone. I hope you're having a great day and enjoying these Vlogmas posts where I just babble away to you. <laughs> Chatting with my friends, that's what I call it. All right, love you guys. Talk to you tomorrow. Bye.